smaller watermelon than yesterday, but smaller watermelon than I have tomorrow. But this is the one ready to go. So the two halves weigh 1688 and 1977 grams. Spoon it into the blender. bit left to clean out. I'll get that in the next one. <clears throat> and a little bit of carrot. Because I love carrot. In my watermelon. time with me making it so we're at almost five minutes so I'm gonna start the timer for see how long it takes me to drink a watermelon eat the watermelon People are always like, I don't know, basing all their actions on things that are <clears throat> introduced into them. So, you know, clearly, if you put yourself in a surrounding and you're going to be like, your mind's going to only like use things that you've seen, basically. If you put yourself in a good surrounding, like in a tropical area, your, your mind's going to see a lot more plants and green stuff and be happier, I think, than if you're in like a concrete jungle or 
advertising central. I mean, granted, it's still my choice. I didn't see much TV back in the States, but I don't have a TV here, so I mean, I go to town and use the internet. But besides that, <coughs> I watch my watch my own videos. So I do watch some shit. Oh no. So anyways, do you think you've ever had an original thought? Or is it just thoughts that you've been incorporating others and things you've heard from others into yours? And that is 1977 grams. It's now like 800 grams. Nope, 734. 
some people got really pissed off at me in that video. They're like, "You stupid swear to be swear. I hope you cut your arm off with that machete." And I'm like, people are crazy on that. <laughs> Getting all that lycopene in. Anyone that lives in the northern hemisphere getting all that radiation. You know lycopene is one of the best things for anti-radiation and all this red stuff. And the watermelon is lycopene. This red stuff in the tomatoes is lycopene. Helps you process radiation and no junk. Highly recommended for anyone living in radiation zones. Or anywhere. It's good for everyone, but even more important for people who are getting ready. Ingesting didn't do my math correctly the other day. Thought I only ate 1,800 grams and that was three smoothies full so that was probably closer to 3,000 grams but anyhow if 1,800 grams is 555 calories I'd say 200 2,000 2,200, that's like 400 more, yeah, like 404 grams more, the 116, like 4.5, so it'd be like another 100 about, about 600, so I guess 680 calories was my guess. And two big tablespoons of carrots. So, say 700 calories for breakfast. And then I'm going to have some papayas. This one's all beaten up. This one's all pretty. Papayas for brunch, pineapple for lunch.
<laughs> and salad for dip. Too much talking. about five pounds and 700 calories more or less in about 12 minutes something like this right. uh, this is a watermelon challenge even though I wasn't nominated I'm nominating Jonas Sunshine on YouTube. I'm nominating who else? Beach Sherry of Beach Sherry in New Zealand. Eat a watermelon. Who else will I nominate? <laughs> Saying hello, love the raw twin, and I nominate. Who else wants to make a video of them eating a watermelon? Although I know you guys probably won't, because you know, who knows? You gotta watch my video first and all that. I'm probably not gonna spend the time to tag you. Victoria Jill of Eat Your Greens on YouTube. So you gotta eat a watermelon and then rub your belly afterwards. Let's see who else. Everybody else that comments on my channel, everyone that watches my videos, I challenge you. To eat a whole watermelon in under 10 minutes and videotape it. And it needs to be bigger than this one. Or at least try to. And take your time. There's no rush. <laughs> Ciao. So this is how I compost my watermelon halves after I've eaten them. Just past that brick over there. Easy peasy. Look at all the right bananas today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. 
That one's starting to turn. Turn ripe.